Exclusive BBCS report reveals startling new evidence for big cats in Britain. The latest report from the British Big Cats Society not only reveals startling new evidence for big cats in Britain, but also that the numbers roaming our countryside could be increasing. The report, covering research from April 4 to July 5, is to be published exclusively in the April issue of BBC Wildlife magazine. The BBC report reveals that 2,123 sightings of big cats were reported between April 2004 and July 2005. The southwest once again proved a hotspot for sightings, with Devon, Cornwall and Somerset all featuring in the top 10 big cat locations. Scotland came in third, seeing almost a 50% drop in sightings reported, and was replaced at the top by Devon. Wales was fourth on the list with 123 reported sightings and incidents. Almost 60% of all the sightings reported were of black cats, and 32% were of brown or sandy-coloured ones, which the BBCS believes to be pumas. Another 6% were lynx-type cats. Big Cat Society calls for calm after Big Cat encounter in London. The British Big Cats Society set up five years ago to monitor and study exotic felines in Britain called for calm today after a big cat encounter in South London left a man with minor injuries. Anthony Holder had ventured to the bottom of his garden during the early hours of yesterday morning after hearing his own pet howling. All of a sudden I saw this big black thing pounce onto me and it knocked me flying. I just didn't even know where I was. And the next thing there was this black figure laying on my chest it was growling and hissing at me and then it started scratching. Live web cameras may finally prove that big cats exist in Britain. Today the British Big Cats Society has launched a new website which may help prove the existence of big cats in Britain www.bigcats.tv will work alongside the existing website www.britishbigcats.org which has now had over 100,000 hits in just three years. The aim of the new Big Cat website is to link up to some brand new digital trigger video cameras out in the wild so that web surfers can see instantly see some of the latest pictures taken from remote places. Already the BBCS has several normal trigger still cameras, however these are only activated when something moves past them and breaks an infrared beam. The new camera systems will be able to take digital images and within a few seconds be able to upload them to the website. The BBCS is planning to start the new project in the new year and will spend the next three months researching into the best places to put them. In fact a full-size black cuddly toy panther. Danny Bamping, spokesman for the BBCS says, this is a good example of how easy it is to produce a hoax. This year we have been able to study evidence in greater detail and estimate that just under a third of all reported sightings are not big cats, either people have been mistaken, or their reports are too vague. There are also those people who insist on reporting the likes of the Pink Panther, Garfield, Top Cat and Simba Dot. Big Cat Society calls for calm after Big Cat encounter in London. The British Big Cats Society set up five years ago to monitor and study exotic felines in Britain called for calm today, after a big cat encounter in South London left a man with minor injuries. Anthony Holder had ventured to the bottom of his garden during the early hours of yesterday morning after hearing his own pet howling. All of a sudden I saw this big black thing pounce onto me and it knocked me flying. I just didn't even know where I was, and the next thing there was this black figure laying on my chest it was growling and hissing at me and then it started scratching. Live web cameras may finally prove that big cats exist in Britain. Today the British Big Cats Society has launched a new website which may help prove the existence of big cats in Britain www.bigcats. 
www.britishbigcats.tv will work alongside the existing website www.britishbigcats.org which has now had over 100,000 hits in just three years. The aim of the new Big Cat website is to link up to some brand new digital trigger video cameras out in the wild so that web surfers can see instantly see some of the latest pictures taken from remote places. Already the BBCS has several normal trigger still cameras, however these are only activated when something moves past them and breaks an infrared beam. The new camera systems will be able to take digital images and within a few seconds be able to upload them to the website. The BBCS is planning to start the new project in the new year and will spend the next three months researching into the best places to put them. The 20th of January, 2003, over 1,000 big cats seen. The British Big Cat Society today released details of big cat sightings reported during 2002 including new evidence of their existence. The staggering figure of 1,077 sightings that occurred last year was collected by the Society and its members. A further 679 sightings were reported from previous years. Again Scotland was the hotspot in the UK, with Devon 97, Kent 92, and Wales 86, the other major areas. The BBCS also had reports in every county and some of evidence included four new bits of video footage, three confirmed attacks on horses, two confirmed cat encounters with humans and a previously unreported dog kill, not far from the recent one in Wales. Recently the BBCS contributed to a 10-page article for the 14 Times magazine, February 2003 foot 167. In it is a list of cats entitled bodies of evidence it lists 1 puma, 2 lynx, 3 jungle cats, 5 leopard cats and 1 caracal, all of which have been found in the UK since 1980. Killer big cat feared to be on the run after local spot rare white tiger who escaped home. Footage has emerged showing a big cat on the loose, which police believe to be a deadly white tiger. Fears that a white tiger has escaped a home in Gibraltar have prompted a police search for the animal. The big cat was filmed eerily treading through the shrubbery on the side of a forest. The film sparked concern the big cat could wreak havoc in the local area. Fully grown white tigers are capable of reaching a top speed of around 60 miles per hour and are considered to be the second largest species of tiger in the world. Some people have suggested the cat spotted in the video may be just a domestic pet caught on camera due to its small size. But Miguel Alconchil, mayor of Los Barrios, where the cat was spotted, has said the sighting is not a hoax. Mr. Alconchil suggested the beast could even be a lost exotic pet that has escaped its home. Authorities have launched an investigation into the evidence that the potentially dangerous beast is roaming free in the narrow peninsula. The video was first posted on the GBC News YouTube channel yesterday. The Guardia Civil has deployed a team to track down the cat, the Daily Star reported. I've never seen a photo that's more clearly, definitively of a cat. Another person said, ah yes, must be one of those 12-inch white Bengal tigers. But white tigers have the potential to be life-threatening, even as little cubs. Back in 2017, a group of white tiger cubs mauled their keeper to death in a zoo in Bangalore, India. Similarly, a year later another zookeeper was killed by a white tiger in Japan. A police officer said at the time that the man was found collapsed in a cage, bleeding. And in Britain, a zookeeper called Rosa King was killed after a tiger entered the enclosure where she worked at Harmattan Zoo Park. 